Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Kevin Finn, EastCapeSkiffs.com. Got behind me a very, very, very nice Vantage, as well as tricked out, I must say. So I'm going to go through all the things on this boat that make this boat uh, so special. First of all, this boat is going up to uh, North Florida. It's going up to Jacksonville. Uh, the owner is a uh, avid tournament fisherman, as as uh, as long as a as well as a weekend warrior, so to speak. What we got going on is we got two different colors of grays. So I'm told. Remember, I'm colorblind. So here we go. We have a lighter gray going on the deck and interior, as well as the cushion work. We have a darker gray going on the hull. Uh, speaking of the hull, this boat is also made with Anegra. If you go to anegrity.com, you'll check out the press release on Anegra and what its benefits are and being used. We are the first boat manufacturer to use Anegra in the uh, power boat market. Anyways, moving on to the boat, we have a blackout package, meaning stuff is powder coated black to match the color scheme he's got going on with the two grays, as well as the black rub rail. Powder coating, orangecountyboatworks.com. Again, check them out. If you need anything done to your ride or your buddy's ride, word of mouth is how we uh, prevail around here. But um, basically, he wanted a half tower, so we made him a half tower with two rod holders. He has a Bob's jack plate on the back. We also have the brand new Mercury 150 Pro XS. Uh, this motor flies. And uh, going back to the, uh, the boat, we have the self bailing option. What that means is any water comes in, it goes right out the boat. Um, it also has a 500 watt plus stereo system in this thing. He has four mid range, four tweeters, a subwoofer on the other side, and the amp. This baby, you can hear it for miles. So on tournament day, he's definitely going to ride out with tunes. And uh, I'm sure I'd want to be next to him so I could hear the tunes while I'm riding. Also going on to the boat, we obviously see the uh, grab handle here as well as the tweeters. We also have a flush mount GPS on the custom made flush mount console. Uh, Mark at the shop went ahead and made a riser to our already existing Vantage so that way the customer could put a flush mount GPS. Again, here at Eastcape, we can do anything that you want. You know, only limitation is time and money. But uh, again, we have the uh, flush mount right here. We have a stereo right here. His trim tabs right here. His mercury controls. Um, he has the high back is what we'll call this with the flush mount. He has the cooler going on right here or dry storage. Again, we can see the speakers that we got going on right here. We have an oversized gas tank inside. You'll see pictures of it. He has a uh, 42 or 43 gallon gas tank. Extra tall casting platform made by orangecountyboatworks.com. Tyler from Sea Deck is going to come by later and is going to put Sea Deck on the tops as well as under the gunnels for the customer. We also have the removable trolling motor mount. We also have the customer wanted his trolling motor mount plug just uh, raised a little bit off the deck to keep moisture out. He wanted his offset cleat right here. We have my favorite. We have the blackout on the trailer. It gives it that military look. Um, also going to the back, because the guy is also a tournament fisherman, you'll notice that we have an extra mount on the back of the boat back here in the back corner. And what that does is so when he's running long distances in rough water, he takes the trolling motor off and he puts it right onto the back. Um, a lot of little things about this boat make it so great. First of all, it's the, the speed for him. Uh, secondly, the color choice is just amazing on this. You're going to see some run footage here of this boat. Uh, we're not going to open it up. We're not going to run it because there is a break-in period on this motor and the customer wants to do that himself. But we have a 23 pitch prop going on it right here. Um, Preliminary speeds that we're seeing is uh, 35 to 36 miles an hour at 3,400 RPMs. So it's pretty good, actually. Um, his target goal is anything over 55, which I'm sure he's going to achieve that and more. But, uh, again, it's hot out here, guys. Cool boat. The boat's hot. Um, all you guys on the fence looking for the real deal. This is it. It's the little things that set this boat apart, from the pleated cushing, the oversized live well, the custom console, um, and again, nobody can beat our fit and finish, our price, and just the quality and the service that we offer that comes along with it. So all you guys out there in cyberspace, cyberspace take care. See ya. Peace.